Yes, Progen Media, latest news and updates happening around the world. Liam Newman, a young instructor, dies in horrific skydiving accident. Yes, many thanks to you, wherever you're watching and from. So, a young man who died in a freak parachuting accident had been on a trip with his father to indulge their shared love for skydiving. So, Liam Newman, who lives in Brisbane, uh, but was born in Topo on New Zealand's North Island, died around 10 a.m. on Tuesday after a group jump ended in a disaster at a rural property in Tarawera, Western Queensland. The 25-year-old was participating in a five-day skills camp at Fanny Farm with hundreds of other experienced skydivers and jumped from a plane shortly after 8 a.m. with four others. His best friend, Cody Mason, uh, told us that Mr. Newman's jump was going perfectly until the last 10 meters when he appeared to turn to his left and hit the ground so hard. Mr. Newman's father, legendary skydiver uh, Brett, was on the jump directly behind him and tragically witnessed his son's fatal fall. After he landed, he rushed over to his son's aid and was by his side when he took his last breath almost two hours later. Liam is super experienced. He jumped out of the plane and his parachute opened, Mr. Mason told us. So, it was all going uh, well until the last 20 to 30 feet when a freak accident happened with his parachute and he unfortunately hit the ground so hard. So, he was alive for two hours. They were working on him yeah, and he was still alive when the helicopter got there, but suddenly he passed away at 10 a.m. Mr. Mason said that Liam's dad, Brett, used to be a tandem uh, skydiving instructor and even helped investigate fatalities before setting up his own skydiving gear and rigging company called Downward Trend. Brett has over uh, has done over 15,000 jumps. He's loved in the skydiving community. He's seen disasters before, but obviously not his own son. So he rushed over to his aid and was with him until the last minute. Progen Media, latest news and updates.